This will be just a quick walkthrough on initial setup on something like this. This is the Makita MAC100Q. Um, basically, you're going to see two different gauges here right up front. You're going to see the tank pressure. Um, I don't do too much adjustment on that. It's preset from the factory. Over here, though, this is important. You have an adjustment knob. This is going to adjust the pressure that's being sent to the actual tool. A lot of tools are going to run right around 90 PSI, but always check the tool manual for the specified uh, pressure. Uh, obviously, you have your coupler here. This is going to be where you plug in your air hose. Um, on the side here is where the on and off switch is. It's this little red bar here. And so you would plug it in, flip that up. Now the tool is going to run. And then the last thing that I like to point out is on the bottom here, you have your tank release valve here. This will let all the air out. I like to leave this open when the tool is not in use to prevent condensation inside and rusting out the tank. This will provide just kind of longevity to the whole thing. So 